Tinubu must go protest erupt in Niger. Nothing has blocked rules. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Yes, we keep saying this often and on that it will get to a point where the masses will start, you know, getting back to these politicians that have felt that they are so so mean in leadership. You know, when they deceived and used ethnicity, tri tribe, and religion to, you know, to talk to more especially the Northerners, they felt they were voting because they want to encourage and bring Bola Metinibu into office. Now look at the massive protests. At the course of this particular video, you're going to see exactly what is happening as we speak in Niger state. And if care is not taken, this will also get to other states. Now they started calling on you know, security operators to take uh, you know, strained measures in making sure that law and order is abided. But if these politicians are doing what is needed, uh, there's no room for the masses to start, you know, going in for protests. Now, everybody is just stating that Bola Metinibu should go because his policies are nothing to write home about. And this is even affecting both the state and local government and other parasitas of the government. And with all what is trending, that means things may not go as required. As you could see on your screen, you said protesters... There is a huge protest in Niger against Tinimbu's government over rising food prices. As we speak, a dollar to a naira is nothing to write home about. Is there about close to you know 1,500 naira? And those persons, civil servants, and the rest that have been paid under the local local currency are finding it difficult to even get commodities in the market. And all these are happening when this government that promised that they are. You know, they are going to transform the country and bring change. And up to date, as we speak, nothing is really happening. As you could see on your screen, there were irate protesters Monday morning in Mena demonstrating against President Bola Metinibu's harsh economic measures that have worsened living standard. Holders of protesters blocked major roads in Mena, lamenting the high cost of living. Food prices have spiked in the last six months under Bola Metinimbu's government. The financial re-engineering of our country is ongoing. We are determined to deliver Nigeria safely through the tunnel of hope, stability, and economic prosperity. This was exactly what Bola Metinimbu's government stated as of December. And the president added in that statement that Nigeria is in good hands. The team is working and we will work hard to give you the best economy and the best opportunities that you can imagine. But as we speak, Nigerian, Nigerian economy is deteriorated following the sudden removal of the petrol subsidy and other policies that has not been cautioned as we speak. And likes of prominent politicians like Atiku Abubakar has also accused Bola Metinibu of dashing hopes of millions to, of Nigerians into a thin air because of the policies he has made. Stay put, watch the video and see exactly how the protesters came out in their numbers to agitate over the high cost of prices. And when we come back, we'll try to take some reactions.
it is obvious that he has started beating hard on the northerners and they have started glamouring, you know, calling for drastic change and calling on Bola Metinibu's government to sit up over some policies. And this is exactly what everyone was stating. Even when, during the campaign period and the general election, they failed to understand that if the government fails, then it will affect both the northerners, the southerners, and the easterners, and more especially to them because of their you know, uh, approach towards election, using a technicality of the rel religious aspect and other tribal issues. Now, a lot of reactions have mapped out over this current protest emanating in Niger State. And like we, speak, uh, like we stated earlier, if things are not appropriately guided, it could affect other northern states. This reaction from Ebere stated, stated where we are those Aboki during Buhari's regime, it's now that they feel they are suffering. Lord, they never start. Official bat will finish all of you since you people voted for APC and still continue supporting APC. Now hunger will finish all of them for that north and southwest. Another touching reaction from Kanayo stated, serious protests now in Mena, Niger State, over high cost of living in Nigeria. We all should join hands together and speak in one voice. There is hunger in the land. Let other states join the protest, demanding for good governance in citizens' rights. A lot, a lot of reaction. We are just seeing it. Another touching one is from Gravion. He stated, "On I never see anything. This is morning. Wait for afternoon and night. By then, you, on I go see the one with senior beauty. Fab Touch stated, Tinimbu doesn't know anything. He only paid his way to Asurok. If we don't do anything, one dollar will be 4,000 Naira. Soon, the rate is going. And we will be made to buy fuel at 2,000 Naira a liter. APC was a cause from the beginning. Selfishness and greed brought the nation to this place. You could see exactly what has happened. React on the comment section. What is your take over what is trending and the protests emanating in Niger State. What is your recommendation?